Hello, good afternoon. My name is Librarian Grace and I work at the Los Gatos Library. I want to welcome you to this class called Painting in the Style of Grandma Moses. So in the beginning, we're going to do a short little art history lesson about Grandma Moses and who she was, what her life was like, and we're also going to look at some of her paintings and her style. Then after that, we're going to dive in and start painting our own painting, but I want to encourage you to think that it doesn't have to look exactly like her paintings. It can look like your own. It's supposed to look like your own. So um, put away any notions that you have to be, you have to have so much experience or you have to be a professional. Um, that's all bogus. So we're here to have fun. We're here to learn something new and to challenge ourselves. And we're also here to learn about Grandma Moses because she was a really fascinating person. So I'm going to talk a little bit about the materials. So I'm going to be painting. So I have a few different paintbrushes here. I also have a palette and I'm using this paint set right here. It's got a lot of different colors, so that's nice. But if you don't have paints, um, you can use any other coloring utensils like markers or co color pencils. Um, you can even just join in with a pencil too. That's totally fine. And you can color it later on in your own time. Um, along with the paints, I usually like to have two glasses of water so that I can paint my, uh, or so that I can clean my print paint brushes. And then um, also we need some sort of canvas or I'm gonna use paper today. And my paper is gonna be thicker because it's watercolor paper. And just a note about the paints, if you don't have, I'm using acrylic gouache right now, but you can use any other type of paint or coloring utensil. So uh, we're here to not be a stickler about the materials, but we're here to put paint and, or color on paper or canvas or whatever you're using. And it's gonna be a lot of fun. So come and join me.